We recommend you to visit five objects in Vilnius region. The route begins at one of the largest defensive buildings in Eastern Europe, Madininke Castle. After visiting the surroundings of Madininke, go to Vilnius and explore Vito das Casulis Art Museum and the Money Museum of the Bank of Lithuania. Later, travel to the old capital of Lithuania, Trakai, where you will find the Trakai Basilica of the Visitation of the Blessed Virgin Mary and finish your tour in Trakai History Museum. Madininke Castle Madininke Castle is by area the largest fenced castle in the country and one of the largest defense structures of this type throughout Eastern Europe. The castle was built in the 14th century by the Grand Duke Gediminas to protect the Grand Duchy of Lithuania from the attacks of the Teutonic Order. The castle was used merely for military purposes. The restored castle was opened in 2012. The exposition, situated on five floors of the castle tower, reveals the history of the castle as well as of Lithuania. Here you can get acquainted with armor, arsenal and archaeological findings of the Grand Duchy of Lithuania from the 14th to the 18th centuries. One of the halls is decorated with a historical canvas painting, the Battle of Grunwald, Day of Wrath, created by Giedrus Kazimierianas, that depicts, perhaps, the most important event of the Grand Duchy of Lithuania, the decades-long withholding of the expansion of the Teutonic Order. Another hall exhibits a collection of hunting trophies and hunting knives of Algirdas Mikolas Brazauskas, the former president of the Republic, donated by his daughter, Odrone. The Vito das Casulis Art Museum The Vito das Casulis Art Museum is located in the reconstructed and modernized historical building of Vilna Society of Friends of Science. Vito das Casulis is one of the few Lithuanian artists who has achieved recognition and evaluation at the global level. There is a permanent art exhibition of Vito das Casulis works, exhibitions halls as well as conference and event center, where concerts also take place. The museum also has a center for education. The arranged programs allow to try different art techniques and get acquainted with the world of art. The programs are intended not only for children and young people, adults and seniors, but also for people with special needs. Visitors exploring the permanent exposition can use a museum tablet with audio guides in Lithuanian and English, as well as video guides in Lithuanian Sign Language. The building is situated in the location convenient for visiting, nearby the Gedimina and Konstitutios avenues. The Money Museum of the Bank of Lithuania in the newly installed Money Museum, every visitor will find interesting information as the exposition presents a rich history of money and current affairs in today's economic life. The museum has collected over 55,000 of exhibits. One of the special attractions of the museum is the pyramid of 1,935,000 which is included in the Guinness World Record as the largest one of such kind. The pyramid was built from Lithuanian one-cent coins before the introduction of the euro in honor of the former Lithuanian currency, Litas. This is one of the few world records that can be seen in Lithuania. The Money Museum is universally intended for everyone. It is the first museum in the Baltic States which also has an electronic excursion audio guide system in the sign language adapted for the people with hearing impairment. In 2013, in the international contest, this museum was recognized as an exclusive tourist object and was awarded with the prize of the Money Museum, the friendliest museum in Vilnius. The object is located in a convenient place to visit, next to Gedimino Avenue. Trakai Basilica of the Visitation of the Blessed Virgin Mary 
Strake Basilica of the Visitation of the Blessed Virgin Mary is one of the oldest churches in Lithuania, built in the early 15th century. In 2017, Trake Church became a basilica. Such a name is a title of honor given by the Pope to significant churches around the world. The basilica is rich in various treasures. However, the basilica is most well known for the painting of God's mother's Trake Madonna at the center of the altar. This is the oldest painting of Mother of God in Lithuania, the first one crowned by the Roman Pope in the Grand Duchy of Lithuania. Every year on the 15th of August, during the celebration of the Assumption of Mary into Heaven, and on the 8th of September, during the festive time of the birthday of the Virgin Mary, rejoicing takes place at the new Traki Church. These feasts and rejoicing are often called Trakines. During Trakines, pilgrimage tours from the Gates of Dawn in Vilnius to Traki are organized. The Trake History Museum – Sacral Art Exposition The Sacral Art Exposition in Trake History Museum opened in 2005 in Trake Peninsula Castle area and in the chapel of the former Dominican Monastery. The liturgical dishes, clothes, altar articles and works of religious art are exhibited here. One of the most unique objects, a seal with image of Saint Dominic, founder of the monastery, owned by Trake Dominican Monastery in the early 18th century. The monastery chapel also displays one of the most valuable antique furniture in Lithuania, the Kasapanka, representing the late Renaissance art, created by Florentine craftsmen. It is believed that this bench box belonged to the bishop. The wall altars have been restored in the chapel and the windows have been decorated with stained glass depicting St. Dominic and St. John's of Nepomuk figures. Although in the former Dominican chapel there has been no holy mass held in a long time, but thanks to the museum, sacred spirit has returned to the sculptural and historical monument.